are you interested in how I got from here to here? My sister is a long story, but please sit down. Let's learn together. So have you been wondering, that smoke fish that you always buy on your streets, what that you always buy from those women in the market, how do they achieve it? How do they even get it done? Because me, I've always wondered, and especially if you're in the diaspora, and sometimes you are craving for this smoked macro fish, and you can't get anyone coming from Niger to bring it for you, or maybe your cargo people are delaying in delivering it, or maybe a pregnant woman just craving this smoked macro fish from Niger. Oh my goodness, this torture can take forever. See, let me tell you. So just grab your your macro fish, have it gutted out. You understand? Then make sure you, dry, in fact, dry the living daylight out of it. I cannot tell you how many kitchen rolls I use in drying this two macro fish that I see here. I dried it, eh? So make sure it is very dry. Dry all the water, every form of water I need dried. Now you can have it grilled, okay? Straight. You don't have to, you know, put it in a ring shape that I've done now. But if you want to, why not? Be my guest. So moving on. So once you have it in this ring or you have it dried and it's still straight, you know, it's fine. It's all good. So what we're gonna do is if you're interested actually in putting in a ring like this, all you have to do is get a tail of the fish dip it in the mouth of the fish and pin you know the tail of the fish pin it okay with a toothpick or maybe a skewer okay pin it down okay with um to the to the eyeballs or to the skull of the fish it's really hard but you get there at the end so let's mix our marinade okay so get palm oil I was shocked because it was my son's friend, the mom from school, who taught me this. I was like, okay, I didn't realize you use palm oil, but hey, we learn every day. That is why you're here today, isn't it? So get your palm oil, okay? Get your barbecue seasoning into it. Be generous about all of your ingredients, okay? Now let's add our ginger powder. Then our billion powder, chili powder, sea salt or salt of your preference, then mix it together, mix it very well until you have a really nice smooth consistency, you understand? Now it's ready. Now let us get to the grilling aspect. So make sure that you, you rub or brush your oven tray with enough oil okay i mean it doesn't have to be palm oil it can be your normal vegetable oil so then rub it in rub it in all over the fish the belly the mouth everywhere just make sure it goes round and do the same as well for all of the fish that you've got okay <laughs> Now it's ready to go in the oven. Now, when we put it in the oven, what you want to do is cover it with a tin foil, okay? Not for the entire process, just for the first 10 minutes, okay? And take it out and then put it back in again. Then leave it for a while, let it cook, then flip it to the other side. Keep flipping until both sides are ready, okay? And you're going to get this beautiful result that I have here. It's just not gorgeous. Please remember to like, to share, and subscribe.